Hello everyone. Currently I am in front of Suzuya Bakery situated inside Kyoto Station. I am visiting the famous Itsukushima Shrine today. I will also be buying an Akiban or Station lunchbox. My eyes are looking for a Japanese fried chicken bento. I've bought my lunch. Now let's head towards the platform. To reach Itsukushima, which is situated in Miyajima Island, first I will take the Limited Express Thunderbird train to Shinosaka. From Shinosaka, Nozomi Shinkansen will take me to Hiroshima. To reach the ferry port from Hiroshima Station, I will take the JR Sanyo line to Miyajimaguchi Station. And from there, it is a short walk to the ferry pier, from where I will board a ferry bound for Miyajima. Five, departing at 10.54, bound for Kurayoshi, will be leaving from... My entire journey will be covered by the seven-day Sanyo Sonin area pass. This pass helped me complete a journey already, which I have covered in my previous episode. JR Thunderbird Limited Express trains operate daily from 7 a.m. to 9 p.m. and provide one or two direct connections per hour between Osaka and Kanazawa. The trains typically consist of six to nine cars. Car number one is the green car or first class car. Car number two, three, four, eight and nine are reserved seating, while car number five, six and seven are non-reserved. Car number three has a ladies-only area and a smoking room. Most cars feature a western-style restroom facility. Each car is equipped with a luggage rack. Seats have power outlets. During daytime, trolley services provide snacks and hot cold beverages. Kyoto to Shinosaka, the journey takes about 23 minutes and costs 580 yen for non-reserved and 1870 yen for reserved seat. Limited Express bound for Osaka. For arrival times and train status information, please check the JR West website. This train My Shinkansen is waiting on the platform. Look, what's standing beside my train? A Hello Kitty Shinkansen. Wow, wonderful. Would you like an episode on Hello Kitty Shinkansen? Just stay tuned. For this part of my journey, I am using the Nozomi Shinkansen. As I have already covered this Shinkansen, I am not talking too much about it in this episode. If you are interested, please see the description for my previous video link. Thanks. N700 Supreme Shinkansen is the latest 700 series Shinkansen operated by JR Central, running on the Tokaido and Sanyo Shinkansen lines. The train runs at a new top speed of 362 km per hour or 225 miles per hour, full active suspension, and an all-new ATC braking systems for safety stops during earthquakes and other emergencies. All seats come with individual power sockets for charging phones and using laptops in the train. Green class has been fitted with new comfortable seats and up to 15% more space compared to the older green class. Room has been made to store larger sized luggage. Safety locks have been added for extra security as well. 
The N700 Supreme Shinkansen are used for Nozomi, Hikari and Kodama services on the Takedo and Sanyo line. Courtesy to JRPass.com I've got this fried chicken meal from Kyoto Station. Let's see what's inside. Hmm. Fried chicken. Portion is generous. A lemon slice. Rice sprinkled with black sesame seeds. And a wrinkly yumi boshi or pickled plum on the top. Some pickled ginger. And what appears to be runny scrambled milky eggs. Hmm. My eggs got spilled to the side. A sachet of spices, maybe, was provided with the meal. Sprinkle it on the rice. Let's squeeze the lemon and coat the chicken with the juice. Now, let's enjoy. The speed of my train is increasing. By Shinkansen, it takes 1 hour 29 minutes to reach Hiroshima from Shinosaka Station. The ticket costs 10,950 yen for reserved seat. Snack time. I bought this bakery item from Sizuya at Kyoto Station. I don't know what it's called. It's very delicious. The ferry pier is a short walk from Miyagi Maguchi Station. The ride takes about 10 minutes to reach Itsukushima Island. Ticket price is 180 yen. Itsukushima is a small island situated in the Bay of Hiroshima. Itsukushima is its official name. More commonly it is called Miyajima or Shrine Island. The island is famous for its centuries-old shrine with a massive torii gate, which at high tide appears to be floating on the water. It is considered one of the three most magnificent and iconic views in Japan. The island is home to a population of seeker deer. In ancient times, they were considered sacred messengers from the gods. People used to worship them and killing one was punishable by death. As I have noticed, the deer population is not much bothered about humans. They roam freely everywhere. They sometimes approach you for food when you happen to be eating. They are really adorable. The unique shrine is located in a small inlet and the Tori Gate is set out into the Seto Inland Sea. The shrine has a prayer hall, main hall even a no theatre stage. I am loving the boardwalks above the sea. It's amazing walking along them while looking out onto the sea. There are many Rio cans for visitors who want to spend the night in the island.
You can not enter the shrine after sunset. I've read somewhere that after sunset, the shrine and the Tori gate are illuminated which can be enjoyed during an evening walk or from boat cruises. I just wonder, what a magical sight that could be. Unfortunately, this time, I cannot experience it. Fingers crossed for the future. I am going back to Kyoto today. I've had a great day. Please let me know what you think of this episode. For more Japan Rail videos, please subscribe to the channel. See you again next time.